good day. Today, I will share to you the devotional entitled, I Can Choose. Genesis 1 verse 27 says, So God created man in his image. Male and female, he created them. Created in the image of God, we are uniquely gifted with the ability to think, to reason, to create, and to choose. What a risk God took and what responsibility is ours by our life choices to reflect the image of the loving God who created us. Revelation and research both agree that the positive exercise of the power of choice contributes to health and prolongs life. We can choose to eat healthfully of the nutritious bounty of God's garden, to exercise, walk, run, bike, swim, move with freedom and joy, to rest, relax, enjoy a siesta, take a holiday vacation with friends, to sleep, refreshing the body, recharging the nerves, restoring the spirit. We can choose to laugh freely and often with others and at ourselves, to hope in the face of fear and failure, disappointment and despair, to learn about the world and the people who inhabit it, about ourselves, to grow as Jesus did in strength and wisdom and favor with God and human beings, to think, to ask questions and search for answers, to work with my hands and with my mind, with energy and purpose, to play just for the fun of it. We can choose to nurture relationships, talking and touching lives, giving and taking, to participate in life, speaking up, taking a stand, being counted, to be a neighbor to a single mom or an aging couple or a lonely teenager, to keep my promises and honor my commitments, to affirm the good, the noble, the giftedness of others. We can choose to believe in a divine purpose for our lives, to worship God who made us for a joyful relationship with Him, pray, living in communion with our Creator friend, to forgive those who hurt us, releasing our bitterness, to forget, yes, it is possible, to act with integrity, honesty, and purity, to love for God is love. So, what will you choose today? Have a great day.